Country Music's Jared Neiman is in Tucson tonight, one of 200 cities he'll play this year. We caught up with him before the show at Toby Keith's I Love This Bar. Jared Neiman is as down to earth as it gets. Instantly, his personality shines. Like we have a video coming up, so pretty much for the next like 10 days, I'll just be starving. <laughs> Besides obvious charm, he's had two songs to hit the top of the charts. Oh, lover, 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 you don't treat me no good no more. As for his image, just because Jared doesn't wear a cowboy hat doesn't mean he's not country. You know, for instance, we have a, a couple horn players on the road with us, and, and really for me, I've you know I actually went to college, believe it or not, for country music in, in Texas. And so what do you want? What do you want from me? Today in this age, you kind of listen to the radio or maybe get on iTunes, and you know sometimes history can be forgotten. So a lot of people don't realize that horns have been in country music since the 20s, since Bob Wills and his Texas Playboys introduced them. And so it's fun for us just to try to incorporate those. I can drink the bad all night. That's the stuff I like. Jared's latest single, Drink to That All Night, amps up the tempo and the fun. When it comes to performing, Jared says it's all about comfort. Our shows, we like them to feel like it's just a you know backyard party and just. So, you know, just whatever I guess we're comfortable in. Maybe, maybe tonight I'll wear a robe. <laughs> yeah, such a kidder. Jared's <laughs> new album comes out in the spring. The title, still under wraps, so it gives fans something to look forward to. All right. I, great music. I yeah. recognize that. He's a great songs. performer. Yeah, he is.